Once upon a time, there was a king who never seemed to be happy, in spite of all his wealth, and he often wondered what was the reason for this. One morning, he was strolling in the palace garden when he saw one of his servants singing cheerfully. The servant was happy and content. Out of his curiosity, the king asked the servant the reason for his happiness. The servant replied saying that he earned enough to feed his family, had a roof on his head, and was able to keep his family happy. Perplexed, the king called upon his favorite minister and asked him, Why is my servant happier than me in his life? Well, he has nothing, and I am the king. I have everything, but I am still in a bad mood. The minister thought deeply about it and told the king, Try with him the rule of 99. The king, who was now a little confused, said, What is this rule? The rule of 99 that you speak of. Simply place 99 gold coins inside the pouch at his door, then write on the pouch a hundred coins as a gift for you. Knock on his door and see what happens. The minister answered. That evening, the king went out and did exactly what the minister told him. By the time the servant opened the door and noticed the gift left there in the front, he grabbed it, quickly opened the pouch, and started counting the coins. After a while, there appeared a concerned look on his face. The remaining coin surely must have fallen outside, the servant said. So he and all his family went out to search, but all their efforts were in vain. They found nothing. So the servant got very angry and kept asking himself, where is the coin? On the following day, the servant became disheartened because he did not sleep all night and was looking for the coin. So he went to the king sulky, sullen, not smiling and angry at the situation. Then the king knew what the 99 rule meant. Such is that we often tend to forget all the 99 blessings which God gave us and spend our whole lives looking for a missing blessing. And sometimes we keep looking for what God has not destined for us and prevented us from getting in the first place for a reason we may not know. So we begin to distress ourselves and forget about the blessings that we have. Instead, what I suggest is to enjoy all the 99 blessings that you have. That's it guys, thank you for listening, I hope you enjoyed this short story, see you next time.